This is breaking news from InfoLive TV. I'm Dave Bender in Jerusalem. Israeli Prime Minister Ariel Sharon suffered a minor stroke Sunday evening as his motorcade was leaving Jerusalem. The Prime Minister was immediately driven to Jerusalem's Hadassah Hospital for a series of tests, among them magnetic resonance imaging. Doctors say the Prime Minister's situation is stable. He is fully conscious. Unofficial sources say that a blood clot was discovered. Sharon reportedly thanked his doctors after the test, saying, quote, you're not through with me yet, according to Channel 1 TV. His personal physician, Dr. Bolig Goldman, said, quote, unequivocally there was no damage caused to him. He added that Sharon's functioning was in no way impaired. Hospital Deputy Director Dr. Yuval Weiss came out and spoke with the press and gave a brief statement. מבדיקות ראשונות עולה כי ראש הממשלה עבר אירוע מוחי קל ובמהלך הבדיקות חל שיפור במצבו. ראש, הזמן, ראש הממשלה היה כל הזמן בהכרה מלאה ונשאר כך במהלך כל הבדיקה. ראש הממשלה לא נזקק להתערבות פולשנית כלשהי. ראש הממשלה מדבר כעת עם בני משפחתו ואנשי לשכתו. ראש הממשלה יאושפז להמשך ברור והשגחה במחלקה הפנימית. אנו מעריכים כי ראש הממשלה ישוחרר מבית החולים בהקדם. תודה. שרון will remain overnight at the hospital for observation, according to Goldman, who spoke with the press at 10.45 p.m. Israel time. He said, quote, he's talking with everyone now and asking what's happening, what people are saying, and how they're taking the news, unquote. The Prime Minister's two sons, Omri and Gilad, family and colleagues, are as well at his bedside. Deputy Prime Minister Ehud Olmert is next in line to take over responsibilities if Sharon is incapacitated.